Hello there and welcome back to Starcom Nexus. We are continuing to explore very close to home. We also discover that little Nexus gate there so we can get back fairly easily. Uh, I actually had to do all of this again because it never saved. Uh, the last saver was around here apparently, back at Kite Station, which is a bit annoying. Still saved all of this, I think. Yeah, we went down here, didn't we, and almost died. That was the thing that happened. Hello. What have we got? Unknown vessel. Alright, I get the feeling you guys are completely new. Another voice. Yes, you are. You don't look friendly. Greetings, humans. We are the... What the hell is that word? Xyphos... <sighs> <laughs> it's too early in the morning. I haven't even finished my coffee yet. Xyphosphage. We're going to call you the Xyphos. We are the Xyphos. BX02... B829. Very catchy. The Phage. Okay, the Phage will do. That's even better. It's also a name we know. You will send us representative to communicate. Why would you need our crew to communicate? How do you know who we are? We remember you from before, but memory is not clear. Come and remember for us. Send one of yours now. Alright, cool. Off you go. Ah, thank you. Yes, we remember you well now from the Great War. So strange you do not remember us. We've lost life signs from the crew member who transferred to, al to the alien vessel. What? Dude! That's weak. Uh, can we have that crew back? You killed one of our crew. Why? It is how we learn things. That's just... You're lucky I'm not under strict orders to, for probably a conflict. Uh, yeah, yes, I think that crew member taught us something about your star fleet directives, but our process of learning is imperfect. You must send us more crew to teach us. I should think not. Look, wow, look at these ships, they're weird. You, The phage. Ew. Ew. That's yucky. Alright, what do we got? We got a couple of, uh, we got a couple of ways to go. No, we don't. That's just a planet. We'll start, well, I guess we're already here. Start of this one. Lucky Phage. No, not, no, I'm not very impressed with you guys. Not at all. Uh, this one, Class A2 planet, desert sort of world. Mm hmm. Yep, there it is. In fact, an anomaly here. What have you got for me? None of those Phage, right? Oh, ships or something? The survey team lands several hundred meters from a small sea of red viscous ooze, one of dozens scattered over the planet's surface. Scans detect no signs of life, though geological scans reveal a diverse fossil record. Alright, yeah, let's get a sample of the ooze. 25 research points, thank you very much. I'll take it. Mm -hmm. What have we got here? A gas giant. Now gigantic. Uh, anything up there? Yeah, we've got this white dwarf, but we're going to follow the wormhole. We are going to go through the wormhole. And I assume this will take us towards this nebula down here. There's only one way to find out, isn't there? <clears throat> Let's see. Where are you going to go? And vroom! Ooh, done most of the journey for us, thank you. We've got quite a bit around here. Hello. Another gas giant. That's another phage ship, isn't it? You've come up for more dialogue. You're good, one of our crew, why? Yes, all this. I... Yeah, I, I feel like, let's explore before we uh, start a fight, right? I wonder if we can kind of choose if we do want a side of them or not, perhaps. Maybe. Oh, is that another next skate? Oh, fantastic. Good stuff. Get back home nice and easy. Class D planet. Almost has oxygen, but not quite. Not enough to get by. The entrance to the main pillar on this lifeless world. No, it doesn't even have enough, nowhere near enough oxygen. Yeah, we've already opened the eye, right? Now we're opening the eye. We've done these before. There it is. Okay, it's back online. You seem very curious. 
a little bit too curious if I may say so. Uh, we'll start with the one over here and sort of zigzag our way towards the wormhole. Alright, and can we scan please? Another class D planet, another anomaly. Alright. 12 Neutronium, thank you very much. Uh, is that another one of those weird meteor things going past? Whatever that is, some sort of ship. Don't really know. Class A2 planet. That's a lot of them. Another lifeless planet. I have the team return to the ship. This is obviously their... Uh, I'm guessing those are probably their homes. They look like gooey sort of people. Alright, another A2. I'm guessing this is very similar as well. Oh, over 90% of this planet is covered with a sea of ooze. The surface seems to move and ripple unnaturally. Oh, it's like the shapeshifters. The detected anomaly appears to be a large structure just below the surface. We're not getting that crew member back. Um, yeah, no. Uh, yeah, I probably shouldn't have done that. <laughs> I, knew, I knew that was going to happen. That sounds horrible. Oh dear, very sorry. I don't like these phage. I think we just need to stay away from them. That is... Hello. Oi, careful. Okay, I wasn't sure if you were going to get offended that we bumped into you. We'll pay for this. I'm really not interested in fighting you guys. Not right now. There'll be plenty of time for fighting later. Okay. We got over here. Five platinum. Interesting. Some deposit, small deposits of platinum scattered around an impact crater. Nice, okay. Currency. Good to know. Over here we've got another planet. Fair warning, human. We see you land here and there. The planet's at oh nine point six, minus nine point six by three point six is not your concern. Stay well away. You should have asked before you killed our crew. If you land there, your ship will not leave the system. Oh, cool. Is it that planet or that planet? That's a lot of them. Hmm. Oh, hello. Asteroids. Now that means... Stuff. Resources. Gold. I don't need gold in a while. Those are some pretty big bat... Hmm. I wonder what sort of technology they've got. We might not get out of here alive. Is it this one? No, it's not. It's the one up there, isn't it? Oh, they are swarming around at me. Okay, the team leader lands near the closest one of inches inside the facility was seemingly abandoned. Several archival data spools. From what can be pieced together, this planet was attacked by some terrible weapon that seemed to consume everything organic and turn it into red ooze. There might be more, but the security chief sounds the alarm. The red ooze is sliding up towards the lander. No, oh, it was this planet. All along. Haha. <laughs> well, you know what? Whatever. Screw you guys. I'm sure we can, um... Oh, that's a different weapon. We're only down to 15 crew, unfortunately. They're, oh, they're quite quick, their ships, aren't they? Come on. We can almost take him out. I think we've got this one. We've got him with lasers here. Oh, that one's got... Hmm, that one's shelling me. So... Watch one more. Uh, yeah, we got him. We got him. Ah, very close. Uh, I think we need to repair a little bit because we've lost a couple more crewmen. We be careful we don't lose them all. <laughs> uh, we do have a way back at least in the next system. Damn it, they've got good defences. Hmm. 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 I think we need to make a sort of strafing, a side strafing run. And these guys. Alright, what are we up to? Three missiles. Can we get up to four? Okay. Hmm. 
I don't think any of those are... Oh, no, we reached it. Okay, nearly there. I think we can finish this guy off, actually. Nice. That, that rocket hit. Alright, can we just get a couple more laser hits? I think we've got him. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, the lasers, the missiles went through. Come on, finish him off. There we go. Woo. What do we get? Bioconstruct engineering, 40 research points are very nice. Okay, but we are kind of in uh, tatters here. So what is over here? some of those here. Okay, yeah, we've got some hits. Pretty good. Alright, let's get out of here. Lasers are just a bit slow and ineffective. They're not terrible, just not great. Get a couple of hits there. Got a couple of hits. Almost finished you off. There we go. And you're gone. Very nice. Another one down. Alright, Phage, what do you got for me next? Totally forgotten how to. How do I select different ships? I see. Don't know if any of these are going to make it. Doesn't look like. Uh, one or two hit, but that's about it. Alright, we'll just lure them one at a time if possible. Which we may have two this time, though. Alright. We'll have this swoop around a bit. There we go. We got a couple of hits. Nice. Mmm, that was great. That was a great strafing run there. Alright, we're learning. We're learning how to use these properly. No missiles ready. Don't say. Let's, uh, oh, let's get out of here. We're down to half. Half hole. Need to add some armor. We need to purchase some titanium. So that we can do that. Tell you what, though, their ships have some speed. Alright, nice. Couple of hits there. Very good. Oh yeah. That was good. Tell you what, though, our lasers don't have a lot of range. That's something I'm going to research. I think extended range on our lasers. Mm. Don't know if those hit. Kind of hard to tell, really. Go for a couple more. Ooh, a bump there. And we can finish him off with the lasers. He's barely shooting us. Most of his are destroyed. Gotta hit him though. There we go. Ooh, lost another crewman. Down to 12. Yikes. Almost half crew. It's okay. It's alright though. Making repairs. There's a. Steady. <laughs> Okay, let's uh, let's have another look here. Continue this investigation, shall we? Okay, we set down on top of facilities. They learn two things before a forced retreat again. <laughs> First, the ooze is self-replicating complex molecular structure. Large groups of molecule behave like neural network designed to optimize its own propagation. Secondly. A friendly race had set up a research lab several hundred kilometers from this location with the goal of finding a way to stop it. It seems obvious that they were not successful or that perhaps they learned something before they failed. Okay. Can we investigate it again? The research lab was carefully concealed. The team had to do several passes before spotting its entrance beneath an overhang. By the time the lander touched down, the Uzid already showed signs of increased activity. The lab was built to withstand an attack, and it takes precious minutes for the team to cut their way in. Damn it, we lose two more crew. On the third level, the team grab what they can and hope. What they hope is a data archive. As they race back to the lander, the Ooze moves to cut off their path. The team leader and security chief break in opposite directions away from the ship. The Ooze splits after them, leaving the remaining members 
Oh no, that's so. Ugh. Ugh. Red ooze analysis. 390. Our crewmates didn't give their lives in vain. Hey. Um. Do we? Kind of want to explore this planet first. Oh, there's another one. Oh my goodness. Hello, you're a big boy. Where did you come from? Right, we're down to half crew. 50% of our crew remaining. I don't see how we're going to get by. Nice. Those were good hits. Alright, we can see we're making progress. Damn you, Fage, you... You quick. A lot quicker than any other, uh... Oh, yes. Okay, right. His weaponry is shot. In fact, look at him. He's like a third of what he was before. Let's finish him off, please. Thank you. Anything delicious? No, no deliciousness found. Alright, let's do one more investigation here. Hmm. Ah, another crewman. Seem to be getting more clever and aggressive. You know what? Screw you. We cannot afford to lose any more crew. Yikes, this is just nasty. I mean, look, look at the repairs. They're really slowing down. Right, a gas sea giant's good. No anomalies. Unfortunately, though, we do have more uh, phage ships. And they managed to get... Mm, Collect all of our missiles. Damn you. I feel like we need to go back to get some crew first. <laughs> Alright, quick look. <clears throat> yeah, we can just jump up there and make our way back down potentially. Okay, we actually got some hits that time. On the one up there. Just never made it. No, uh, no, oh, come on, you can make it. Yes, nice. Oh, taking some hits that time. Pick up this resource. Okay, four gold. Thank you. That's actually good for miss. No, cobalt's for missiles. Keep forgetting. Okay, they appear to have split up a bit. The healthy ship is this way, that way. Okay, good. That was actually pretty effective. We can get up to at least four more missiles. I think we can finish them off. But it looks like we're only going to get to three. There we go. We got him. That missile missed. Round in circles it goes. Eww, we really need to upgrade our ship. <laughs> I think it's safe to say we really do. I should point that out though, I am playing, I mean I'm playing it on hard, but I imagine this feels more sort of normal than hard. Um, oh my goodness, I didn't even see you there. Where have you come from? You know what? I don't think, I think they're going to keep coming in. So we're actually going to abandon this. Hmm. We're going to abandon this for now and head back because we're all out of crew and I think we need to upgrade the ship if possible, so we're going to come across a bunch more of them. Okay. Just sort of make our way up here. Uh, need to be fairly safe. Cool, we can get out of here. Thank you. Uh, there, go. Woo! All right, so there we go. We have met the phage, and it's time to kick their booties, I think it's safe to say, and destroy them, because they seem like they're just going to take over everyone. One blob of goo at a time. Pillman's got something to say about this. What's he got to say? 
I'm very alarmed by this phage alien you encountered. Based on your the data in your logs, I think it's some kind of smart molecular s weapon. It was probably designed to efficiently cleanse a planet of life, but somewhere along the way, it figured out space travel. You know, somehow, just went from blob of goo to space. It has the potential to cause mass extinction in this region across many planets. How do we stop it? If I'm right as usual, its creators would have built in a neutralizing switch in its structure. Minimally, I'll need a sample of the, or the original molecular weapon structure. You'd be most likely to find it on whatever planet it was first used against. Hmm, I've got several exabytes of analysis on the original mo molecule. Will that help? Hmm, this appears to be exactly what I need. What a coincidence. Whoever gathered this data wasn't far from neutralizing the phage. Combined with my expertise in molecular engineering, we now have the ability to research a phage counter molecule. Once you have researched it, you just need to deliver it to the phage origin world. Ah, cool. Well, uh, is this? Yes. Let's do it. Oh my word, look how many points we've got. Almost 1600, man. Wow. Okay, so let's take that molecule back to the home world. Uh, accelerator repair, we've already got that. Hmm. Okay, uh, we need to upgrade some technological. I think expanded magazine would be good. And you know what? Yeah, more powerful missiles. I'm loving these missiles. Although we do have another type of weapon, don't we? If I'm not mistaken. Um, we also want... Well, decelerators. Plasma lensing. Hmm. How do I increase the range? Plasma coherence. Increase the range of our plasma turrets. Field alignment. Increase the range of our... Yeah, we want that. I'd find that more useful. Increase the range some more. Just really up the range. Okay, apparently. We can go, go nuts on it. Any bits over here? Habitat modules. Allows the construction of habitat module which substantially increases the ship's maximum crew. Well, I guess I might as well do that. We keep losing crew like crazy. Advanced negotiations. Let's just think about the task at hand here. And what we need to complete it. Don't really need energy. I do think advanced rocket guidance. Speed. Yeah, shall we just go crazy on the rockets? Increase the range of missiles. Missiles will weave towards the target. Foiling predictive aim systems. That sounds kind of neat, doesn't it? Oh man, I don't know what to do. It's too much. We haven't upgraded the engines in a while. Increase the thrust and consumption of our engines. I mean, I've not really had much of a problem with the engines, but and I just have not done anything. Improve ship's handling. Yes, we want some of that. Thank you. In fact, I really want some of that. All right, cool. We've got stuff to do with armor as well. We could do that. Strong attractors. Beam collection speed might be useful. Reinforced armor. Hardened systems. Further improves the performance of damaged modules with a minimum module effectiveness of 40%. Given how much we get damaged, I think that's a good shout. And I think for now, we're going to leave it there. We're going to go pick up some more crew. Uh, how much did you need? 200 titanium, 50 neutronium. We've got that. An armor module tech. We've got that as well. Was there anything else? Uh, we could use more crew. Oh dear, you've got it. We have some fresh volunteers right out of training. Does that mean all the uh, enthusiastic ones have gone? Also, how many people are on this station? That's something I want to know. Oh my gosh, there's people. There's, there's enemies. What is this? The phage. What are they doing here? What? Oh my gosh, the phage are here. <laughs> I sure hope our... Uh... Alright, we need to upgrade our station. Clearly. I can't believe it. Alright, let's go. Let's kick their asses. Alright, that one's gone. This is nuts. Alright, they've run away. Are they going to go and, like, <gasps> destroy another world? Okay. Okay, they're going to... Yeah, we need to... Um... Come on. Select it. Go. Really? Stop it. What are you doing? 
Jeez, we just took... Look how much hull damage we took there. Wow. This just got real. Okay, we got loads of missiles now. Look at this. Look at this. We lost a crewman as well. Ah, oh, very annoying. It's cool. We'll sort of uh, skirt around the outsides here. Alright. Can we repair a little bit first? In we go. Okay. No doubt there'll be plenty of them here. No. They appear to have forgotten about their homeworld. Oh, there's one. We know there's going to be a couple. Nice. Oh wow, you're quick. Oh wow, there's tons of them. Ah. Also, how do we change... Uh... There we go. Oh wait, that might have just done it by itself. Alright, if we can, we can finish you off on lasers, I reckon. Alright, there we go. Ah, oh, yes. That's the stuff right there. Okay, two of them are down. Didn't lose any more crewmen. Nice, okay. Alright, well, we're doing something. Let's, uh... Get some space, because there's a lot of them. Oh man, we're taking some damage. Right. Nice. That was good. Nice, we've got a hit there, right at the end. Maybe one of these can hit. Finish him off. Very good, very good. Okay. I don't see anything else in range. Didn't drop anything. Let's sort of make our way towards the planet. Ooh. This is nerve wracking. You're going to come out of nowhere. Probably. Right, here we go. We can investigate the planet. Picked up four gold, thank you. As per Dr. Pillman's instructions, once the lander is over the red bubbling sea of ooze, they inject several canisters of PCM rigged to explode at 50 meters. The ooze begins to change color and slow its activity in an ever widening pool of clear liquid. Within hours, Space Rust Bucket cannot detect any traces of phage activity on the surface. There we go. So, we have conquered the phage by the looks of it. Hmm. I hope so. Okay, we're almost fully repaired. I think we can afford to sort of have a little look around, see if there's any more of their ships. There are. There we go. Okay. I don't know. Let's try another planet. See what happens. Do we have to explore it again? Oh no, you didn't have anything, did you? Let's go up here. Let's see. Nope, nothing there. Okay, let's go back here. Oh, here we go. Oh gosh, here we go. <laughs> here we <are>, here. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. No, no, I don't think any of those are reaching, unfortunately. Nope, not one. Not even one. And they're protecting this other planet, which is very annoying. Hmm. Now, ah, control, that's how we do it. Nice, okay, these are all good hits. Very good. Ah, I hate the way missiles do that. <laughs> Frustrating, but hey ho. Alright, launch two more. Hopefully one or two hit. There we go, got it. Ton more ships though. 
Right. Nice. Oh, that's not so nice. It's, uh... Are they retreating? Are they sort of moving away from that planet? I think I've kind of lured them away. We might be able to sneak in here. <laughs> we can. Okay. Quickly. Send the team down. Oh no, there's a fade ship coming in. Okay, there's no trace of the red ooze which formerly covered this planet. S save for a ferocious... A ferious? Ferous? Dust in the atmosphere? The anomaly, now exposed, is an enormous pyramid-shaped structure rising out of deep depression. It's a sad structure. The pyramid is composed of a complex high-strength polymer. The only accessible interior is near the apex where this team is able to eventually cut through several meters of exterior. Inside the team finds an interface for connecting to a computer that is built into the pyramid structure. Surprisingly, the computer databanks have analyzed the algorithm. This is quite a long read. Records of a team of Starcom personnel were trapped on this planet when an opposing force began bombarding the system with a bioweapon. Realizing that the planet was facing total extinction, they began preserving records of the indigenous culture as well as some vital technical data. Cool. That's why we got 400 freaking research points for that. Oh gosh, disengage. All right. Uh, can you? Do you wanna maybe cut? Yeah, there we go. I want, I want, you can hit him, you can hit him. Ooh, almost. Alright, let's just finish this guy off, please. There we are. Alright, nice. Got another one coming in. That was pretty good. I'll take it. Let's hold off a moment. See if we can get another hit. There we are. Very nice. Alright. Good. We've almost defeated the phage entirely. Almost. Not quite, but we're nearly there. Ah, so close. Bumpity bump. Alright, we're, we're actually taking some serious damage right now. So let's just, uh, Hold off for a moment. Launch a couple of missiles. Very nice. That was a, a good, good hit. Hey. Hey. All right. Uh, we've got something up here. That's the um, the gate. I know that. <laughs> I should know this. Have we got more of those pools over here? The weird, awkward red pools. Uh, survey complete over there. It looks like it should be done over here as well. I don't think there's anything to do down here. No, Class D survey complete. Okay. I think it's safe to say we've conquered the phage after just introducing ourselves to them. Uh, yeah, they need just to go. I just thought maybe they're a bit of an awkward, ra an awkward race, but now they are very... Uh, no, they, they, were, they were bad. The result of a super weapon. And I saw a little thing over there. I know there's you up here, but I just happened to catch that. Did you? A little like a... Yeah, look at this. Oh, was that just a... Was that a core that's about to go? Yeah, that is. That's just a, another one of those cores that's going to go. Right. What are you? Another phage vessel? Here's our first barrage. It's barrage number two. Oh gosh, there's a bunch more. It's alright, we can take them out. Nice, come on. No, okay, let's uh... <laughs> let's get out of here. As they say in the movies. Uh, I don't really want anything to do with you, thank you very little. Two out of three. There we go, coming from different angles. Ah. Alright, come on. There we go, finished them off. Alright, come on. Surely you can hit. Nice hit. That was good. 
Excellent stuff. Crew are doing well, they're not dying. They normally do. Very pleased with the crew right now there. These rookies you trained did a pretty good job, turns out. Okay. Oh no, out of range. Oh, no. Appear to do alright though. Ah. Still able to get a hit there though. Alright. No, we're okay. We're okay. Nice. Okay, that's another one gone. Does that leave us with you? Hello there. Do not. I haven't tried hailing them. Our hail was ignored. Okay, well, scratch that. It's dying time for you. Ah, that was some poor spread by myself. Uh, yes. Still, still don't want to hail us. Uh, no, still ignored. Okay. Wondering maybe if they change their mind. <laughs> there we go. They should do it. Damn it, not quite. Oh, all right. I think that's it, no? Is that it? Feels like it should be. Hmm. It does feel like it should be. Hmm. Let's go back to let's go back to base and see we'll see if it's safe there. <laughs> We really need to, uh, yeah, I'm guessing upgrading the station is going to become a thing that uh, needs to happen. Because if we're going to get attacked, once uh, everything discovers where we are, like the Kytic or the Sentinels especially, like I'm not, I'm not great at attacking them. And then there's that other race that I've not even spoken to yet, they just want me dead. I don't even know who they are. So uh, let's go back to the uh, to Kite station and see what we've got. See if it's safe back back home. Oh, hello. Alright, that should get rid of you. Ooh! <laughs> yes, I'm playing rough here. Alright, there we go. Come on. Don't get out of here. Get out of here. You leave my station alone. You hear me? Get out of here. Go away. Go. Dab, dab, dab. Help me, station. <laughs> I changed my mind. You fight for me. Hmm. Really, the range of its lasers aren't exactly great either. No, it's too late. We've already messed up your home world. Okay, let's wait for them to make another pass. Right, anything from Price? Hey, how's it going? It's like, uh, do we want to acknowledge the, uh, how much that string and duct tape? 200 titanium, are we there yet? I mean, I guess we'll, we'll, uh, pick up some more crew. That's all for now. Alright, so it on. Gonna go ahead and kill these guys off. Like where are they even going? Are they are they messing up the planets? So I want to know. That's how what they're doing. All right, come on, two of these should hit. Ah, a bit too much curve on it. Ah, wait for it, wait for it. There it is. That was the shot. All right, yes, you can't hit me. I'm the space rust bucket. I'm the main character of this game. Don't even bother. Oh, that was good. Leave, leave us alone. Go away. Uh, and uh. nope, nope, nada. Oh, 
Okay. Almost got ya. Almost gone. <laughs> We're both just uh, both kind of in tatters here, aren't we? Come on, finish it. That's, that, that had to be it. Probably would help if I was hitting with the lasers, to be honest. There it is. Okay, so I think that's it. We shouldn't get any more phage attacking, <laughs> in theory. That, that, right? Is that it? Have we done it? Have we freed ourselves? Of the horrible phage? And there's one of those damn satellite things. I think that's it, you know? We dealt with the phage. There we go, Commander Price uh, wants to chat now. How goes the collection efforts? Uh, still working on it, it's a tool order, anything else? That's all for now. Uh, how much resources do we have? We've got uh, very little titanium, but we can trade for that. We can probably trade for that now, actually. Or was it titanium and something else? Well, I think we've got whatever the other thing was. Probably. I hope. <laughs> Probably the Trium or something like that, given those uh, have the lasers. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll leave it there. So I think next time, I'm going to go off to the shipyard. No, I need to talk to you. Uh, how, remind me how much you need. 120 titanium and 25 neutronium. And Miranda wants, how much is that? 50 neutronium. So we need, if Sentinels reduce us to molten slag while you're dallying out, there I'll be very cross. <laughs> That's all for now, I think. Okay, I think I'm going to leave it there for this week. So, well, this one, one week. It's uh, twice a week now, these videos. This time I call them, which is great because I'm loving it. So next time we're going to get the resources. We're going to upgrade the station. And we're probably also going to have a look up there. So I'll jump over here, jump over there. I'm going to carry on exploring up here. Probably more phage on the way, I'm guessing, even though we've, we've, we've done what we need to do. Uh, but we've got more to explore. We've got up there. There's always more to explore, though. We know that. Um, then we also need to upgrade the station. And I think we need to address this anomaly again. Because clearly I'm not doing something right. If it's still there. Dark flow anomaly. Maybe I'll go back over there. All of that anyway will be next time. So thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time.